just one more week left until Vermonters head to the polls for town meeting day this year. Across the state, voters are getting ready. Top issues include the election of new city leaders and expensive school budgets, which are raising concerns about a tax increase expected this year. But school budgets aren't the only thing contributing to the forecasted tax hikes. NBC 5's Anna Goober joins us live from Richmond now. She's been speaking with town officials there about a multi-million dollar item on the ballot to save a community staple, Anna. Sarah Beth, Lauren, that community staple is this building right behind me. It houses the town offices and post office, and it's over 100 years old. And with its old age has come some problems that the voters now need to decide if they're worth nearly $10 million in a loan to fix. The loan would cover the cost of a fire sprinkler system, updated electrical and HVAC systems, and new windows to improve ventilation, among other necessary safety improvements. Jeff Forward is the chair of the Richmond Town Center and Library Committee, a group that has spent the last five years evaluating the best ways to address these issues. He says while the timing of the proposal is not ideal, moving the town's offices to another location, completely rebuilding or delaying the renovations would only cause voters more down the line. This plan takes that into consideration, takes flooding into consideration, it takes energy efficiency into consideration, it takes the health and safety of the occupants into consideration. There's no question it's a lot of money, but we feel this is the best plan that we could put forward. Forward says if the proposal is rejected, the committee will have to come up with an alternative solution. He's encouraging everyone to have their voices heard on the issue by heading to the polls on Tuesday, which for Richmond voters will be held at Camels Hump Middle School and can be done by Australian ballot. Live in Richmond, Anna Goober, NBC5 News.